Hey family, we just finished week three of our Bible journey, Acts 20 through 24. One more week to go. I hope you're excited about it. Um, let's go ahead and jump right in and discuss what we're learning. For me, what stood out the most, what was the most profound was in Acts chapter 20, verse 37. We see Paul, he's, he's talking to the elders in Ephesus and he's discussing a couple things and he's getting on a boat and we see this, this verse here in verse 37 where he says, and there was much weeping and they, and they hugged Paul and they embraced Paul and they kissed him goodbye as he was leaving. And you could see that this was more than just a church. This was more than just an organization, but this was spiritual family, real spiritual family. They had broken bread together. They had prayed together. They were reading the Bible together every day, and they had even experienced persecution together. And it was something about that that forged some bonds that were really, really strong, and they walked together in real spiritual family, not just friends, not just organization. And so I just wanted to just lay that out to you today. I wanted to talk about it a little bit. Maybe you can think about what does real spiritual family look like? Are you really walking in real unified and connected spiritual family? Just something to think about as we're on this journey, something to, something to discuss. Maybe you can talk about it with some friends. Maybe you can discuss it here or in your groups as well. So anyway, thank you for joining us on the journey. Let me know if you have any questions. Look forward to talking with you guys next week.